Ohio is host to the American Motorcycle Pro Hill Climb Championships. These specially built bikes can tear up the steep slopes at over 60 miles an hour. Cameraman Glenn Mazzoni gets up close and personal to the fast and filthy action. The next racer is number 17, who revs up the engine for his shot up the hill. But Glenn gets the shot, and not the one he planned. Don't, don't, don't touch him. Don't, 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 don't touch him. Do not touch him. Glenn is down and badly hurt. His camera's still rolling when help arrives. Looking at it from another camera, you can see just how hard Glenn is hit. The chain-wrapped rear wheel of the 400-pound cycle runs right over his head. Luckily, paramedics are on the scene. They finally control the bleeding and rush Glenn to a hospital. Later, he recalls how quickly it all happened. The motorcycle was coming probably between 65 and 70 miles an hour, and from the time he went out of bounds until the time he was on my head was about half a second. Yeah, I was basically thinking, get the hell out of the way. It takes over 300 stitches to sew him up, but Glenn doesn't blame the racer at all. You know, sometimes people ask, ooh, weren't you mad, or didn't you get mad at that guy? Of course not. He didn't mean to hit me. I was probably too close to the track, as the video would show, and if you're going to operate in that realm, things are going to go wrong. That's all part of the game. 